Is there a place for gut feeling in dermatology? I'm bringing you a very interesting case and I'm genuinely interested in your answer as a patient or as a colleague whether you think that there is a place or there is no place in dermatology for gut feeling. So this patient came to me and I spotted this singular lesion on her body. This is the high magnification image of this light brown lesion which should be considered odd or kind of ugly duckling because there is no other similar lesion on the whole body of the patient. And as always we finally conclude on the high magnification dermatoscopic image which shows these typical hairpin vessels, pseudocysts and no sign for uh, melanocytic uh, lesions so no pigment network or anything suggesting this is a melanocytic lesion or a mole um, according to my opinion, this is a straightforward seborrheic keratosis, which is a benign lesion. But being a, a solitaire, shine, little bit shiny, reddish brownish lesion, uh, my gut feeling kind of kicked in and a red flag uh, popped up. And because of this, I recommended a diagnostic shave biopsy that happened and we are looking forward to receive the histology the results of the histology analysis. So what do you think? Is there a place for this type of gut feeling in dermatology? Or if I see a clear-cut seborrheic keratosis, it is a seborrheic keratosis. Or I might be right um, concluding in uh, the need of a diagnostic um, biopsy because of, of this oddity in the nature of the lesion being a singular lesion. I'm genuinely interested what you think. Please put your answer in the comment or DM me, which is really appreciated. Thank you for watching and have a lovely rest of the day.